Hey girls, it's Friday and this video comes to you in three different times, meaning you're going to see this in reverse time order, because right now you see me still repping Harry Potter, and I need to be faster, so this video is under five minutes, and then you're going to see me last night when I got home from the theater, and then you're going to see at the theater, so real quick, um, Muna, I'm glad that your piano lessons went well, and it sounds like fun, Brenda, bring your face back, Jessica, oh my god, oh my god, Oh my god, I love Harry Potter so much. You don't even know. <laughs> and, uh, Susan, I'm sorry that you didn't get to go to the midnight premiere, but, um, NaNoWriMo? Uh, yeah. <sighs> but it's okay, I'll get done at some point. I'm just really behind, and I was kind of distracted this week because it was, I dubbed it Harry Potter Week, and I've been watching all the movies, and, um, I wanted to read the seventh book before the movie came out, even though I've read it 35 times. Um, I think so. Back on track. My brother's t-shirt, uh, it was just yellow, and it said, on the front it said, particularly good finder, and on the back, um, I wrote, what the hell is a Hufflepuff? And, uh, somebody came dressed up as Professor Sprout, and there were a total of four Hufflepuffs. Um, so she gave flowers to all the Hufflepuffs, and my brother got a flower. And there was a Death Eater in our theater, uh, telling us jokes before the movie started. They were really terrible, and I apologize to any if any of you guys are in Hufflepuff, or if any Hufflepuffs watch this video, but it was funny. It's, um, what do you call a Hufflepuff with one brain cell? Gifted. What do you call a Hufflepuff with two brain cells? Pregnant. <laughs> it's not funny, but it is. Anyway, now, um, to my clip from last night. I literally just got back from Deathly Hallows Part 1. It is 3.30 in the morning. I just got home. It absolutely blew my mind. Oh my goodness. Susan, I am so sorry that you didn't get to go to a midnight showing. It was, it was absolutely fantastic. I won't give away any spoilers in this video, but I'm putting a video up on my personal channel about where I talk extensively about it, so I will put a link to that, but I really think that it was just the best film of the franchise so far, because, I mean, it started off good, I absolutely hated Prisoner of Azkaban, there was just so much missing from it that I, I just, I can't do it, <laughs> to, to lift the entire Marauders plot out of it was just unforgivable that left such a big plot hole in it but moving on from that and they just they got better and better and this was just absolutely incredible it is my favorite book of the series and it is my favorite book of all time number one book I've ever read in my life and I think Deadly Hallows Part 1 is a force to be reckoned with it is absolutely fantastic and I really think it can only be topped by Deathly Hallows Part 2 which I'm sure it will be because most of my favorite parts take place in Part 2 oh my gosh it was amazing and um now enjoy some clips from my theater <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> 